How's it, guys? So we pay another visit to the Ilova Estuary to see what else we can find. I've seen some photos of Barracuda Picandles and GTs and I'm sure there's mullet here as well and I hear there's stories of rock salmon so we're gonna try our luck over the next few days and compile this video so that we can cover all the areas first fish of the day nice elephant bream also comes out of this area so we'll see what else we can get Small grunter. Hey, come here, boy. Tiny Lulu. Say bye, subscribers. Hello. <laughs> Another little bream. Bites the dust, yeah. Come, boy. Yeah. Yeah. Granter, check another small granter. There you go, boys. Like a oh, hello. <laughs> Yeah, here we go. Pull him, bro. You are bringing my line in, but it's fine. A ah, monster flaggy again. <laughs> or thornfish, as some of you guys call them. Like a, oh, good fun. So guys, yeah, in the, in the estuary, in the rivers, I've got a, a small Shimano rod, six foot, and a little 3,000 reel. Something that can carry a lot of weight, a uh, line uh, on a very light tackle. I think I've got 10 pound line on yeah. So, and yes. yeah, there we go. We must. So, I'm using a small little sinker and a three way swivel. On the one line, I've got a little floater, and the other line is just a straightforward hook, number 10 hooks. So, very small though so that we can target the smaller fish so guys yeah we're fishing very very light so every little nibble that you can feel or that happens out at the hook you can feel it that's for sure so i think it's key to fish very light especially in the estuary so you can feel that small bite and whatever comes around that's really big the hook is not going to hold it that's for sure so we're out here just to see how many different species we can get out of the estuary. Most of the fish that we're catching here today is on the float. So the one that floats up from the, from the bottom, these are the ones that's catching the fish. So with a small sinker, it's just enough weight to pull the so down and to be able to produce this fish. You go and grow up, boy, we'll see you in two years' time. <laughs> On again, ciao really quick now. Grand. Another small grunter. So they're full up, yeah? So they definitely are breeding in the area, which is a good sign. Although there's a lot of pollution, yeah, a lot of plastic and a lot of nonsense in the water, the fish still seem to have found a way to survive. So pretty soon these small O's will vie into the ocean and we'll get them off the beach with a sea lice or a prawns or something. Come boy. Go call someone bigger, eh? Hey, the small grunters are plenty here, man. The water, the line just hit the water on straight away. No time to play. Come boy, let go. There you go. Plenty juveniles here. Finally, Rudy is on. 
Let's see what he brings. Hey, that's a better size grunter. A much better size one. Yeah, like oh, at least you got something. On. <laughs> Wind, wind, wind. <laughs> yeah, in the road. <laughs> yeah, check the grunter or full up here. It's spring high and it's high tide right now, so the river is pushing and all these hoes are coming in now to feed on the banks. Like a good fun for the small hoes. Bring the lighties around. All the gunners will enjoy this. So guys, yeah, while we wait for the bite, don't forget, Necron Property Management makes all of this possible for us to fish all over. Guys, they'll take care of all your property needs, whatever that may be. Give them a call, find the information in the description. They enable us to move around and to fish all these spots. Give them a call, guys. They manage a lot of properties. Surely they can help you as well. I you miss again. What's wrong with you? And a little bit gets to bend the rod. <laughs> uh, out it goes. Yeah, so Rudy gets to bend the rod. I've got a bite. Bring him. Ah, Grante, he's got his head down. There we go. Finally. Come, Ruan. Get one, Kingy. <laughs> On again. Yeah, so yet another one. A Mooney or a kite fish of all things. <laughs> ah, they double up. This is how it happens. There you go. Double up. I have the biggest one. <laughs> what you got? Oh, baby Granta. Ruan, what you got? <laughs> hey, the Granta's brother. <laughs> At least. Double up, the fish are here. <laughs> okay guys, last cast. We have to go home sooner or later. Ah, on, I So quickly, I just cast it. Another grunter. Span a small O's here, man. Nice little boy. Go call your mother or your father. On, last cast for Rudy. Scott him. <laughs> but you're bringing a ski boat here. What you got? A smaller grant. <laughs> a baby grant. No, now it's time to fly home now. Yeah, boys, this is the end of it. <laughs> we can't be catching small fish the whole time. But yeah, good experience. Very, very light tackle. That's good fun, man. No better way to end your day to relax after graf. See the sunset. Looks lacquer, man. Hey, this all he couldn't wait. Very nice scenery. Very lacquer. Just to relax. Who knows what we might get here. Guys, thank you for watching the videos. If you want to subscribe, you're more than welcome. Thank you so much for your support, boys. I'll check you soon. One of these days, when I pull something, weekend looks good. We'll see where we end up. Yep. Hey. Hey. That is a big ol. Has to take a photo of the cheese. We have a video for you. Ah, I want a photo. Yeah, pick him up. <laughs> live grandpa, bro. Small bait, live bait. So guys, check us those teeth. Proper, proper chompers here. Yeah. Uh, get a race. I was just parking, catching a breath here. Just to revive him a bit. 
there we go. Off he goes. Laka. Yeah, sure, no problem. Yeah, coming. <laughs> okay. Check this, boys. One cast next to the side here. Yeah? How's this thick mullet, man? Decent. Oh, this is good live bait for the for the surf, man. Perfect. <laughs>